Andrew Tucker and welcome to Andrew Tucker World. What's going on all my great people? What's going on all my boxing fans? Oh man, this Saturday is going down. This Saturday it is going down. Teofimo Lopez versus Vasily Lomachenko. It's going down. It's going to be a good fight. It's going to be an entertaining fight. Both fighters will be in great shape. Both fighters will be prepared. Will be prepared mentally and physically. Whoever wins this fight is going to be the top dog at 135. It's going to be the king of the lightweight division. See, the thing is, I already saw who won this fight. I am not a prophet. I'm not an oracle. <laughs> I'm not a psychic. But I already saw <laughs> who won this fight. And all I'm going to say is this. It's going to be an entertaining fight. It's going to be a war. It's going to be a very entertaining fight. It's going to be a war. It's going to be an action-packed fight. You guys do not want to miss this fight. I'm telling you right now. I got $500. I got a $500 bet. Because I know who the winner is going to be. I know Teofimo Lopez is going to push Vasily Lomachenko. Vasily Lomachenko is going to push Teofimo Lopez. He's also go is going to test Teofimo Lopez. Stylistically, this makes an entertaining fight. Stylistically, this makes a very inter <laughs> interesting fight. But I know it's going to be a war. Just like I said in my little promo video. Vasily Lomachenko versus Teofimo Lopez. War. A closer look and then war. That's the name of the video. Go check it out. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, listen. Listen. Some people saying that Vasily Lomachenko has, de has declined. See, y'all gotta understand that some sometimes fighters, you go up against certain fighters with a certain style, it's going to, you know, somewhat throw you, take away from what you used to doing. I mean, but you, but he always used to doing like he's good at what he's do, he good at what he do. But at the end of the day, sometimes a different style can throw you off a little bit, and you have to switch it up, switch up your game plan a little bit. You know what I'm saying? You gotta switch your game plan. See, Luke Campbell was one of those fighters for Vasily Lomachenko. He was one of those fighters. You know what I'm saying? Luke Campbell's a very good fighter. Very good fighter. You know what I'm saying? A very good fighter. That was not an easy fight for Vasily Lomachenko. Jorge Lenores. Jorge Lenores was a is a well a warrior. We already know Jorge Lenores always comes to fight. We know that he's a warrior. He we know that he can fight. He can box. We know that he is dangerous. That was not an easy fight. Jorge Lenores gives any fighter, any fighter in that weight class, around that weight class, a good fight, a problem. He's a warrior. Luke Campbell, a warrior. We're not going to talk about the other fighters. We're not going to talk about the Gary Russell. We're not going to talk about the, the, the X-Men. You know what I'm saying? With Nicholas Walter. We're not going to talk about smaller guy. We're not going to talk about the other fight. We're not going to talk about, you know what I'm saying, other fighters. We're not going to talk about those fighters. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to just say this. People look at that Loma like, oh, well, you lost to Salido. You lost to, man, he, he was getting uppercut. He was his, he was getting beat up. His balls was no homo. His balls was getting beat up. His, his manhood was, get, was getting destroyed by that dirty fighter. I'm just... Salido is a warrior though. I don't take nothing away from the Salido, but he a little dirty. You know what I'm saying? He aggressive. I like his style. But I felt Loma won the fight. Honestly. I ain't, I ain't seen Loma lose no fight as a professional. Honestly. You know what I'm saying? Teofimo Lopez, a big puncher. Got power. Good timing. Good counter puncher. You know what I'm saying? He's good at timing. He's, He's good at timing. Right. You know what I'm saying? He got a little, he got the little, he got the little finish here going on. Boom! You know what I'm saying? Good at, he good at, I'm telling you, you know, he's good at setting it up. You know, for Silicon Machinko, good volume punch. You know what I'm saying? Volume punch. Hand speed. I believe, listen, he still has what it takes. Hand speed. You know what I'm saying? Volume punch. Hand speed. Good at, good at turning his opponent. Good lateral movement, side to side movement, all that depth. 
You know what I'm saying? Pa pa pa. Silly Lomachenko, one of those fighters, very skilled, elite fighter. We're not gonna, we're not gonna, we're not gonna break up the 390 some amateur fights. Even as an amateur, you see so many different styles. And like I said before, sometimes amateurs are better than some professionals. Sometimes some amateurs, sometimes amateurs are better than professionals. We have witnessed it. We have saw it with our own eyes. Like real talk. Who another one? Shakur Stevenson. You know, Shakur Stevenson. But anyways, to make a long story short, Facili is a very skilled elite fighter. Any man that step in the ring with him, he's going to test them. No matter how hard the, no matter how tough the opponent is, no matter how skilled the opponent is, he's going to test them. See, Teofimo Lopez has the power. They say he's bigger. What, 5'8", Loma's 5'7". Inch difference. Mm-hmm. You know, Loma might be a little bit small. Teofimo probably framed a little bigger. You know, a little bit. But I don't think none of that's going to really matter. It's going to it's gonna come down to skill. It's going to come down to skill. It's going to come down to skill. Power ain't the only thing. Vasily Lomachenko with a cumulative of punches can break his opponent down. He can probably hit you. One get shot, probably take them down. To the body or to the chin, to the temple, to the chin, temple, or to the body, to the chin. Whatever. You know what I'm saying? Teofimo has that power, that knockout power. Boom! Dynamite! Boom! You know what I'm saying? This is gonna be an entertain it's gonna be an it's gonna be an interesting fight. It's gonna be a very entertaining fight, but all of them say is this. Vasily Lomachenko. Might be one, might be just one little one level above this kid. He might just be one level above this kid. I ain't make this video to argue, argue. I ain't make this video to debate. Everybody have their own opinion, and I respect your opinion. I respect what you see. I respect. I do film study, so if you guys doing film study, let me know. You might see something different. I do film study. I know what I see. I know what I, I know what I, I know what the strengths and weaknesses of a fighter. I know where the fighter do good, I know where the fighter don't do good. You know what I'm saying? I know where the guy, fighter do, I know where the fighter does good, I know where the fighter do good, I know where the fighter doesn't doesn't do good. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, that's what I look for. I look where the fighter, I look at what the fighter is very good at. And I look at what the fighter is not so good at. You know? I look at the mistakes a fighter make. I look at what a fight, fighter does very well, but I also look at the mistakes. Real talk. I got a $500, and anybody else wanna bet, we can bet. But I already got a $500 bet. You know what I'm saying? Could have made it a thousand. $500 bet on Facility Lomachico. I don't think he, I don't see him stopping Tiafimo Lopez. I just see it going to, I just see it, you know, Going to the, it's going to going 12 rounds. I see it going, I see it going 12, I see it going 12, maybe seven, five, maybe eight, four, for silly Lomachenko. But it's gonna be a good fight. It's gonna be a very entertaining fight. You know, yeah, there's a chance that Teofimo Lopez can knock out Facility Lomachenko. Yeah, there is a chance that he can knock him out. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Yes, there's a chance he can knock him out. He has the power. He has the power to knock him out. We saw, we have saw Tio, we have saw Vasily Lomachenko go down before, that he can go down again. And this time, if he go down, he might not get back up. I understand all that, but all I'm saying is that then maybe this time we're going to see a fighter. We're going to see a fighter <laughs> that's going to be doing something that he's very good at doing, and kind of making it a little difficult for the for the next man. And the next man can't get frustrated because if he gets frustrated and falls into that trap, if he falls into the matrix, it's game over. Andrew Tucker, and welcome to Andrew Tucker World. I'm gonna make a quick little couple of thousand, you know what I'm saying? You know, thousand, you know. I don't know. I don't tell all my business. But anyway, Andrew Tucker, Andrew Tucker World, much love and respect. I'm out.